Hello laser gerbil friend, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to review this new laser engraver, Algo Alpha MK2, a machine that claims to be super easy to use. So I've asked Christina to help me reviewing this machine for you. She has never used a laser engraver before, so this is a real test of first time using a laser engraver. This laser is from the same family of this previous model, Algo Delta Laser, also reviewed on this channel. So let's open this. We have uh, a user manual, a consumables package, a part of the frame, another part of the frame with the touch screen, and then a power adapter, laser googles to protect your eyes, and then a small tool used to set the focus. And what's this? Oh, this is the uh, air assist pump. Okay, the air assist pump. Now, let's see what's on the bottom of the box. Well, other parts of the frame. What's this? Uh, this is the x-axis of the machine. Okay, and the last part of the frame. And a small box full of screws and tools to put everything together. A metal bar and the laser unit. I give you my opinion about the content of this box. The material looks very good quality. For example, the laser unit is very heavy, which is a sign that we have good heat dissipation. The plug for the laser is more robust than the normal ones. And finally, the motors, which are very important part, are very big and strong, which guarantees high performance. So, to put everything together, I follow the guide step by step. So, first of all, I join the four parts of the frame. Then I screw everything together with the four screws provided. Pay attention to this. You should lift this small metal part, otherwise the screw will get stuck. Then I mount the X-axis on the frame and secure it with four screws. Then I lift the frame to attach the motor cable. I insert the joints into the metal bar and attach it to the motor. I plug this in and finally I put the laser in place and attach all the electrical cables that will make it work. Now, let's move to the air assist pump. I let the cable pass through the clips and connect the pump. Now, with Diego's assistance, I set the tension of the belt, which is very important for the correct sliding of the X-axis. Anyway, if you need further explanations, just have a look at the manual. I peel the plastic protection off and turn the machine on. The first thing to do is to connect the machine to the Wi-Fi network so that we can use all the advanced features. This machine can be fully controlled from its built-in display, with no need to use a computer or anything else. We can choose pictures from the internal SD card or we can use a USB drive to load our own picture. From the machine display, you can control all the parameters affecting the engraving, such as the quality, which means the density of the lines, the material, the power, the engraving speed, and finally, the desired size of the engraving. To set the focus, there is a very useful focus spacer. Just place it between the laser unit and the material you are going to engrave, then block the laser head and the focus is set. The machine guides you through the framing process to verify the project placement. We kickstart the engraving and we realize that the machine allows us to change some parameters, like speed and power, as we are engraving. This is very useful because if we realize that the engraving is coming out too dark or bright, we can adjust this to obtain the best result. This is our first engraving, super simple and super nice, very easy to do. Now I would like to try the cutting performance of the machine 
So do you have any idea of something would you like to create with uh, Argo Alpha? Maybe a necklace. That would be great. <laughs> okay, nice idea. So we search for uh, some design on the internet and then we send to the machine from my software Laser GRBL. To do this project, I look for inspiration on the internet. I look for something cool that I like. I download the images and I let Laser GRBL processing the images for cutting. In a very short time, we are ready to cut our jewel. With Algo Alpha MK2, we have the opportunity to connect the machine to Laser GRBL via Wi Fi so we can stay comfortably inside while our machine is doing its job outside. We start the job and let's see how the machine behaves in its cutting performance. The machine is very fast and powerful. It completes its task in less than a minute. The cutting is neat and we just need to polish it with a light pass of sandpaper to have a perfect result. If you don't have a computer, you can also use the laser with its dedicated app. The app will automatically find the engraver on your network and with just a few clicks, you are ready to go. Through the app, you can control all the parameters of the machine. You can either create your own design using a rich library full of images or load your own picture from your mobile gallery. You can also add text or your own handwriting or play around with the other features. If you are a beginner and you need extra help, the app also provides a beginner course full of tutorial. Here we are. So now I want to ask Christina what about her experience using Algo Alpha MK2. Well, the experience was excellent. It was my first time with a laser. Everything was super simple. It took me about 20 minutes to set up everything using the user manual. It was very well written. I followed the instructions step by step. And in 20 minutes, I could set everything up. A very interesting feature uh, that I found in the laser was the um, touch screen, uh, uh, the display, the touch screen uh, on which I could uh, um, change the power and the speed of uh, the laser, even when I was engraving my job. And then uh, um, I, I found it uh, really excellent that I could choose from uh, uh, over 70 pictures. From the touch screen, there is a SD card inside the laser. So I chose this beautiful picture. I engraved it and uh, the result was uh, very good. And uh, what about the app, the app for ah, the, the, for the phone? Of <laughs> course, <laughs> that was also very easy to use. I installed it on my mobile phone and I could select the pictures from my own photo gallery. Um, also, if you want to produce uh, something else, uh, there is also the opportunity to connect uh, your PC using the Laser GRBL free program. So I did it and I created this beautiful necklace I'm very proud of. So it was really a beautiful experience, a great machine, very easy to use. I really recommend it. <laughs> okay, thank you, Christina. Goodbye. Bye, thank you.